and I'm looking for Marco. He's been working the camera for David Vicker's new reality show. Believe me, I know. Well, is he around? You might actually want to check the hospitals. Last I heard, he was running out of here dodging bullets. Hey, boss. Not now, I'm thinking. It's just... What? Is there any chance we'll be getting paid soon? You'll get your money. I hope. Priscilla and I have been talking, and... We know that David's already blown the show's budget. Hey, we'll make it all back. Even if there's no show? And why wouldn't there be a show? Uh, we're living in a stable? We want our money. People, people, people! Shame on you. Have you never heard of suffering for your art? I've suffered enough. It's 110 degrees, and I'm standing in horse manure. Look, I know things look bad, but that's why we have to pull together. Wait, why is that exactly? Because we're a family. No, we're more than a family. We are a television show about a family. We can't let something like horse manure come between us. Now, let's hug it out. Who wants to hug me first? Why don't you come in? We'll be back to pain later. Great, thanks. Marco said something on the phone about Mr. Buchanan and a gun. You know what? Actually, I wasn't even here. But I, I just thought he was being dramatic. I'm sure he was. It doesn't look like it. Trust me, if blood had been spilled, I would have heard about it. But this whole thing was my idea. I mean, if something happens to him, it's my fault. Are you guys talking about Marco? Yeah, do you know where he is? Uh, I might have an idea. Well, I'll tell Langston. She's worried about him. Marco's fun. Okay, well, where is he? First, you have to swear not to give his location away to anyone. I can't work like this, David. I need to eat something besides oats. I apologize about the accommodations. I realize there's not a craft service table, but think of it this way. It didn't come out of the budget. Yeah, what's left of it? I promised you a very generous salary. Yeah, and then you went and spent it on your brother's legal bills. And if I didn't do that, we wouldn't have a place to stay. Now see how it all works out. All right. We have no money, no story, no cast, no bathrooms. Yes. But look what we do have. Oh, um, buckets, horse flies, hay, atmosphere. You can't make a show out of atmosphere, David. Believe me, I've tried. Well, what do you want me to do? You're the producer. I'm just the talent. Okay, solve one of these problems. Anyone. Or I go. So do I. Me too. So David and his camera crew are hiding out in the stables? Great idea, right? If you don't like indoor plumbing. It's just temporary. I'll find something new for them. And you really think no one will find them? I, I don't see why they would. We don't have any horses right now. And plus, David and his crew are trying to keep a low profile. How well do you know your older brother? You guys figure out where Marco is? Aren't you hot? I'm quite comfortable, thank you. Well, what's in the bag? I have to get work done, and uh, my office is a mess. Can you tell Nigel I don't want to be disturbed by anyone? Okay. What, are you working on what you're going to say when you testify for my case? What I say is my business. Well, thanks for your help. Yeah, sure, anytime. Oh, hi. Uh, I'm looking for Matthew. Oh, right over there. Okay, thanks. Matthew, hey. What's up? Yeah, I heard what happened in court. Sounds like your family's lawyer gave you the real going over. Yeah, I'm okay. Well, figured it wouldn't hurt to make a house call. Like, Rachel's not around, is she? Why? Well, it's probably best for both of us if we keep our distance from one another. Uh, could you hold on a minute? Yeah. Everything okay? Yeah, I just, uh, I just gotta do something. You, you could wait in the living room if you want. You all wouldn't abandon me here, would you? For air conditioning in a land view minute. Hold that thought. David Vickers Buchanan Productions, David Vickers Buchanan speaking. Get up here now. Bring the crew. What's going down? Something good. We got a live one, folks. What are you waiting for, dude? Get out there and get it. Without my producer, I have to stay here and work on story ideas. Ford, I would like to take this opportunity to thank you for trusting me with your vision. Whatever, just don't come back without something usable. Marco! Prissy! I told you not to call me that! Grab your gear! It's time to make magic, people. Matthew, I thought you said there was drama. Inside. 
Doesn't sound dramatic. Oh, it will. Joins a circus. <laughs> David goes Amish. It's all been done. Snake handler, David. Too hard to think. <laughs>